All right, we are back again from our Baldur's Gate 3, where I'm transforming everyone into mind flares, going into the Albear Cave to transform the Albear into another mind flare. You feel the quake of its heavy footsteps before making the it. grand design come upon us. Its beaked face looming. Okay, after I got it uh, disarmed a bit, we we'll use the. Add to party then. Alright then. Video two of the main. And we'll add the both of them. And then they'll have no issue with me grabbing the egg or the loin. Interesting that the Albear was the one who said that I'll tear her. Tell tear me into two. Hmm. Like it was me. Well, now to transform them. Let's do that real quick. Alright, should be able to just. So, actually, no, I'd like to do the Emperor one first. This. Perfect. And now the. Uh, Albear Cub. Lovely. And now we shall proceed to the next people to transform. Aha, let's transform this scrawny bugbear. I'll just give him basic to our purposes. Welcome. Probably get this sneaky hidden one over Video here. Two. The party. And then we come over to here. Interestingly enough, they don't have the ability to actually hide. Yet they were hidden. Or I don't guess they're ambushing. Interesting. Well, that doesn't mean that I can't just transform it into another mind flare. Release him later. For a dull moment. And outside, enough to find another goblin to transform. We go. Okay, here's a couple more goblins to here? add to the group. Them. There we go. And now to transform them. Transform you. Basic one. While oh, we're doing that, move over to here, get the ring on you. And do. I actually need more Gale transformations. Do that to you. And to proceed to the goblins. There. Alright, let's go on over here. And we'll just add these two to my party. And transform them by getting on the ring. Oh. Didn't know he had the key. Good to know that that one has the key to that chest over there. I don't know how I keep on missing that. annoying that it's putting all the things up there because it means I can't just use my hotkey. Get over there! Surround them like! You s no uh -huh. fun in skewing a pig what doesn't know he's cooked! As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. There we go. And convince them not to attack me after I've already transformed all of them. They're all transformed anyway. Looking ahead. And then we have a bit of alcohol that I can just take with me any if I need. Uh, love to see my horde being even bigger. On to the next group of go goblins to transform. Here's a thought. 
Not only will I have ogre body bodyguards, but I'll have illithid ogre bodyguards. Tastes like gentlemen. Contain yourself. And what surprise is this? Brothers. Alright, I should be able to just go you. Who are you? Huh. Oh weird. Uh there we go. Choice pending. Proceed. We got another tab. I don't know why that occurred. Shark, are you a part of me now? No, maybe. What to do? I need to tell Tav. Once familiar ally. Go to camp. Area and still doing things. Let's not press the four this time. Press three. Video. Three. Video. Fun to see that the Oker's doing. Lovely that the uh, ogres that I just took are no longer interested in talking. Okay, now. Let's also get Lump into our group. Then I'll talk to him after transforming all of them into Mind Flares. Okay, Mind Flare, we're gonna give you... A melum. Yeah, we'll make all of them into Omelum. Let's move. <laughs> I've no use for the absolute <laughs> or any god. I follow two masters only gluttony and greed. The goblins understand my. Okay, uh. They sate my hunger for gold. I love that. And the rest sate my hunger for meat. I simply look for marks. Gold is more than sufficient compensation. I found the. Uh. Make me an offer. Yeah, I think I found the, uh... This, uh the, um... Thumbnail for this video. Because... That's hilarious. Fifty gold. 
Normally, it's a lot more than just 50. Sir, take my book. Use it when the need arises, and never Interesting. before. Apparently, if he really likes you, the amount... Like, if he has 100% approval of you, 50 is... I did not know that. Apparently, if you actually trade with him before asking him, Hey, will you work for me? It's much cheaper. But of course, you're also, like, giving him a ton of stuff. So, might be more expensive overall. Um... A delicacy. Unless you bear the mark, of course. Alright, that was hilarious. And now they're off. Oh no, they left my party. Ah, uh, unfortunate. Well, now off to the next group of goblins to transform. I did not expect that to be as funny as it was. Alright, now they transform these uh, five six individuals I have added to my party. I'll be right back. Not after I do that. Okay, and then let's transform Brekus Root Chair. Come on. Oh, he can't. Still alive. Fine, I'll have to unrestrain you. Cut me loose! Him. Uh, well, get on with it. Let's see. Just so that I can see who else. Uh huh. Brackets fruit. You saved me. Now you'll. No, me nothing. Leave. Okay. No. Okay, before you go off and disappear. No, never mind. Ah, he's gonna go disappear. I can't really transform him. Okay. So apparently that's a way to get to uh, Grimforge way earlier than I should. Well, start to transform people here now. Come on, Bolo, don't go... Swimming in the lava. Sitting down there trying to get himself blown to bits. Clearly. Hey everybody, you're coming with me. After which I'll be transforming all of you into mind flares. Seems like the best way. And that will be fun. But I, I'm gonna tell you right now, I did not expect to be in this part of the game already. And I'm not complaining. I did, there's plenty of NPCs to transform around here. Oh, you, Dana, come here. Time to let you have join my party and join the Elithid. And I'll be back after I have transformed all of them into Mind Flare. Alright, here's everyone I'm gonna transform here. Or and or have already transformed from this area. And let's uh, start transforming them. There we go. And now they're all transformed into mind flares. Oh, I don't even know how many that is. It's a lot. Alright, now off to continue to the next group. I'll probably sh uh, shed a few 
on my way to finding more people to transform into more mind flares. All right, we got a good uh, several more to transform. Let's do that real quick. All right, I've transformed all of the nearby occupants into even more mind flares. And we shall proceed. Okay. Get it in there. There we go. And into this side we go. In your presence. Ah, lovely. I love when it uses a model trying to do things that it's really not supposed to. The Rothay looks at you with bigs. Okay, good. Agitated is gone. Oh, let's get back to finding more people to transform into mind flares. And I have transformed almost everyone in this area. There's a few stragglers. I'm gonna have to start setting them loose a little bit because game starting to slow down with how many companions I have here. Like, let me go over to, oh, come on, it got lost. Okay. Ah, great. Gotta drag this back up to the top. Like, let me show you when I try to send something to someone. This is the list of everyone in my group. As you can see, it's a little bit long. Just a little. I'm gonna have to start cutting cutting back things. Oh, hey, I also have a few that I haven't transformed, apparently. Let's do that. Put the ring on them. Mind flare. Oh, wait, I'm, I'm, gonna, take, I'm gonna take that. Transform you and you. Alright, let me, uh... Just, uh, clip out a few of these, uh... Yeah, trim my numbers, per se, real quick, and then we'll get back. Alright, I've done a little bit of a trim. These are a few of the ones that I... left behind. That, uh, don't really have any way to get back to where they were. And I'll go and just grab some more. Transform everyone. Apparently one of these gnomes I just resurrected over here has a ring that makes you invisible. The more you know. Anyway, time to transform them all into mind flares and then... Uh, leave them here. Okay, and like that, we've got this many more lithids in the world. Nice. Come on. Not enough caning. I almost feel bad about this. <laughs> and of course they are mad. Well, now to go grab that gnome that's behind this door in a few places. Oh, lovely. Combat. <laughs> and of course it's bugged out. Okay, let me... Reload. Fix that. Oh, never mind. I figured out how to do it. Okay. Time to press ahead. Just come up to here to the last one and Dead. There we go. Come on, everyone. Off we continue. Stereon. 
How have you managed this? But how? All right, I gotta reload. Let me fix this. Okay, Asterion is no longer stuck on the floor. Good, good. Just sometimes you need to just reload the game. Once or twice. Or ten times. Once, twice, or a million times. Alrighty. I don't need a sneaky, sneaky, now. sneak, sneak, sneaky, sneaky, sneak. Time to sneaky sneak. None of you shall ruin it. There we go. Now you're nice and friendly. And you don't even care if I take this or this. Thank you. It's very kind of you, madame. Yeah, let's just convince her not to... Great. Hopefully she doesn't run off again. Ah, she's gonna run off. What to do? <sighs> Great. More accurately, she's gonna teleport off because that's what they do. Well. Let's get close enough to the rest of the group that I can still be considered within teleportation range. Okay, and then let's go back to Grimforge. Underdark and Forge. Yeah, there we go. Alright, and off to the next group of uh, people to transform. Alright, as fun as this detour to Grimforge has been, I think we need to go back to the Goblin Camp. So, I think yeah, I shall do that now. Oh, lovely. These two are over here continuing their uh, efforts. Alright, let's go. Alright, let's transform spiders into mind flares. That's a fun idea. Where the heck are they? Okay. Let's do this. Boom. Header caps and spiders into mind flares. I'm gonna have to trim my numbers yet again. Great. Ah, oh, there they are. Okay. Up at the top. That's all right. I'll just uh, transform them and then uh, trim a few unneeded mind flare. All right. Now let's try to. Sneak up on the spider matriarch to take over her. Okay. How will I approach this? Let's see. Uh, that's not nearly enough space. Okay. Um. Six. This. Uh, the range on this sucks. I can't. Get close enough without it. Okay, now I should be able to come over here. There we go. And away I go. Get you. And fly down and get you. There we 
There we go. Go we'll add this random skeleton for good measure, and then transform all of them into mind flares. Great. They'll be up here. Starting with the face spider matriarch. Which... Well, let's put this ring on you and make you into... A mind flare. Interesting that, like, the transformation is instant. Things like this. I feel like... reason they feel like they're shorter than usual but that's they're not right it's just surroundings for some reason nice never a dog i'll have to resurrect that body but first let's pick up this dark amethyst for later Okay, I think uh, about here is about good time to uh, leave it off for this uh, episode of sorts. Because uh, it's gotten a lot done, transformed a lot of people into mind flares in, well, uh, the decrepit, oh, sorry, the blighted village over there, and the Grimforge, way out of order. <laughs> Uh, next time I think I'll go into the goblin camp and start transforming and or killing certain key NPCs. Just so that I can progress the story. And then we will, uh, yeah, we'll see where we get from there. I hope you have enjoyed this video. Uh, please, uh, like, subscribe, and all that. That would be immensely helpful. Uh, it makes me feel happy when I see more than two likes on a video or one like on a video that happens to just be me uh it would mean the world to me actually at this current time um and i totally expect to continue to mess around with absolute nonsense that was that is transforming random npcs into mind flares and uh, carrying them around, or uh, well, bringing them around everywhere. I think my uh, highlight of this episode was uh, with uh, Lump the Enlightened. And that whole scene that uh, you probably have saw as the. Uh... Yeah, here he is. Not only that, but he's also got his massive. Uh, Spiked club that does 2d8 plus 2. Not even strong enough to carry that myself. It's like, here that there's a bug that you can use to equip that. Anyhow, I hope you have enjoyed this video. I certainly had fun making it, and I will, I hope to have fun continuing to make it. Uh, with that, I must say goodbye.